Father Winnipero Serra founded the first mission in 1769. When his ninth mission was founded years later, he returned to the second mission and insisted on being buried there. When he died in 1784, Fernandez I took over as president of the missions. The first mission he founded was the 10th mission, Mission Santa Barbara. In, 18, in 1787, he founded the 11th mission, and four years later, on September 25th, 1791 Mission Santa Cruz was founded. The Yoku, the Olhams, and Costanillans helped build the mission. Now, life in Mission Santa Cruz is like life at the other missions in California. After the cross was raised three days after its founding, people began to come, but the population only reached about 525 people. There's a big quadrangle completed with a greenery. There's also a garden and cemetery located outside the quadrangle. There are cattle in an orchard, and of course, the church. Every day, the bells would wake people up at 6 o'clock, and they would go to prayers for an hour. After prayers, they would go to breakfast. At about 8, they went to work. Women and children were expected in bed every night by 8. But although life around the mission was mainly peaceful, there were some bumps along the way. In the early 1800s, the Spanish Viceroy built a pueblo by the mission. This angered the priests, for they thought they were a bad influence on the people of the mission. Also around that time, there was a flood in the San Lorenzo River that ruined the mission. In 1834, Mission Santa Cruz was securalized, but in 1854, earthquakes destroyed it, leaving only one building left. In 1931, a smaller version was built on the same location and is still standing today.